Prius is looking super fresh today. Coffee dialed in. Got the YZ250X loaded up. Let's do this. Going out to Renz. Hit some sand. Got the new pipe on. I'm going to do some footage of this when I get there. Swap some bars over. I'm going to put some Enduro bars on. See how that works out. And, uh, yeah, we'll shoot some footage when we get out there. It's time to get rolling, though. Driving down the highway, I had to look back. See, my trash can is, uh, I mean, my gas can is trying to bail out on me, but I think we're going to be all right. Hmm. It's a little sketchy. Railroad tracks. Breaking news for you guys today. My GNC season is over. Won't be racing any more GNCCs this year, except I uh, do want to try to make Iron Man. But the rest of the season is done. I'm uh, my, The plans I had just didn't work out, so I'm um, just going to take some time to race local series, race Sorks, get better for next season. Still want to race GNCC next season. Um, so got to regroup, get faster, get better, get some better results coming in. And uh, yeah, have fun in the local series this winter. Definitely got to do some training. Going out here, get some sand training in today. Get used to the two-stroke. It's a lot, little different riding than the 450, but the 450 was just absolutely ridiculous. It was like riding a street bike in the woods. Get these braces off for GNCC. Probably go about 10, 15% faster once I get these things out of my mouth. Got the fresh new going today, keeping it styled. Prius handled these bumps like a boss. I'm stuck. Turns out the Prius's off-road capabilities are not good. I can go for, I mean, I can go backwards, but I can't go forwards in the sand. I guess because it's uphill. Got it all hooked up. Four-wheel drive, Allen Riddle. Fully secured on the gas tank. Hey, you want to go out there? Man down! We're out here at DJ's in Rins, Georgia today having some fun, getting some sand practice in. Beat off the pegs all crazy like. So, this ride was actually a few weeks ago, but I'm just now getting the video together and I've got the Sorks videos coming out real soon. I'm gonna drop one of the Sorks videos in a couple days here. And uh, I got a Southern Roots video to put up too. But yeah, this was one of my earlier rides on the YZ250X. And uh, man, the tires I have on were not made for this. It was super sandy and dry out there. Time for a quick bar swap. Old bars on the bottom, new bars on top. Let's do this. Put my enduro bars on from the 450. So I got back out there testing out the new bar setup. They were a lot taller. It felt a little weird when I was sitting down, but standing up felt way better. And these are the bars I'm going to be running for now. This is a super cool place to ride. Really smooth, a lot of single track, and uh, super sandy, so if it rains, you can still ride there. I was actually still feeling really out of shape at this time and uh, wasn't feeling too confident in the sand on the YZ250X actually. I think the bigger, heavier, straight line 450 was actually a little bit better in the sand, but uh, I am getting a lot more comfortable on the YZ250X at this point. 
This was, I think, maybe my fourth ride on it. They got this cool little turn track here. It's pretty fun to practice on. You want to go back out there? I can do another lap. Let's do it. Oh, oh man. I'm out of control today. Can't make a turn. Don't make excuses. What in the hell? Looks like somebody's having issues of their own. That's Ben Fricks there. These are the one that lent me the boots at Southern Roots. Snake right there. Snake. So I was riding out here by myself at this point, just trying to get some laps in, get more comfortable in the sand, get more comfortable on this bike. I think the two stroke in general is more difficult to ride in the sand, it seems like. But man, we had a really dry summer, really dusty and I'm not a big fan of those conditions. You can see how nimble the 250 is though. Thing turns quick. I'm feeling all the time off. I was getting a little windy. I was also coming off a little cold, so my cardio wasn't actually doing very well because of that. Mm. Getting back out there, do some extra laps. And up here, I ended up catching a tree, hurt my arm a bit. Just coming up through here, lose my balance a little bit in this left hander. Oh, that would hurt. Bump that tree out there. Got a little stinger. Whoops. I was tired. Awesome place to ride though. It was a good day of riding. And it's not done. I'm going out for one more. I was actually feeling pretty comfortable by this point. This last lap I went out for was feeling pretty good. And I got some footage coming up in a little bit here. I did some little, some footage of the YZ250X and all that, showcase the bike a little bit, see what I put on it so far. Successful day of riding today. Bike's feeling good. Just got the GNCC graphics on it for GNCC that I'm not racing. Uh, still got the stock sprocket on there, looking super fresh. I swapped on a uh, FMF gnarly pipe. Got a Polysport front brake guard. Try to keep things protected out there. Swapped the bars out today. Put the ASV levers on from my 450. Got their Enduro bars from my 450 too. Um, <clears throat> put some white grips on, keep it looking fresh. Some uh, grip donuts. Yeah, things are feeling good. Feeling more comfortable on the bike for sure and uh, making some progress. Let's see if we can get some cinematic footage of this thing going.
finish this day right with some really healthy choices. Let's go with the double dose. Apparently. All right, see you.